Hot news sure, the GOP snubbed Steve King. But when will they do? House Republicans bluntly snubbed Steve King after his latest racist musing, the Iowan of his congressional committee posts and scrambling to pass a resolution condemning white nationalism. Ostracizing their outrageous colleague provided a satisfying outlet for Republicans. They could appear to t King's censure is a band-aid for a worsening lesion. For conservative, strategic racism feeds white anxiety, which brings in donor money and shores up the base. Can it really have been just one Republican president ago when the GOP devised a big tent campaign to lure black voters, called If You Give Us a Chance, We'll Give You a Choice? Ken Melman, Republicans recognize they're losing the voters of color, advised an infamous internal party memo from 2013. This priority many conservatives prefer to ignore race altogether, adopting a kind of colorblind optimism. They see their benign the way to stop discrimination on the basis of race is to stop discriminating on the basis of race, Roberts famously stated in a prominent desegregation case. But if you look more closely, the colorblind mantra favors the social and material interests of the GOP's white base. The mantra's benign Ivan Trump, a self-declared moderate, praised her father as colorblind and gender neutral when she introduced him at their party convention in 2016. That proposition, in word and action, the man in the White House undercuts both party outlook's big tent opportunism and colorblind optimism alongside his political groupies. Their strategic Trump recently thundered that, unless his wall is built, the United States, as we have known it, is going to cease to exist, channeling white nationalist Pat Buchanan, who recently the president, to declare an emergency because the more multiracial, multi-ethnic, multicultural, multilingual America becomes the less it looks like Ronald Reagan's America. How can a party that professes to transcend race woo a broad spectrum of voters while keeping its white base? The party of Link, when the revelation, Martin Luther King, an adult GOP and conservative movement are battling over three approaches to raise big tent idealism, colorblind delusion, and strategic racism. For now, it is both a political head fake and an ideological stain for Republicans to denounce a small state legislator but not their party leader. Vanishing King the Rich Benjamin, author of Searching for Utopia An Improbable Journey to the Heart of White America, is at work on a new book. Drop, 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 drop,